Hey guys, Todd here. That light on, there it is. Blog time. Um, right, here we go. Uh, system check, coffee, biscuits, dog, and vaping gear. Um, right, that's everything that uh, everybody that won in the raffle, uh, for the charity raffle, everything's gone out. Uh, abroad, UK, every, everybody in the UK should have theirs by now. Uh, so that's everything. Uh, and once again, thank you to everybody that uh, contributed. Thank you to the folk that uh, made contributions as well. Uh, Lee, Nibs and Jokerman. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, right, uh, before we get going, what, what have I got to discuss? Not a lot, really. Um, I now have <laughs> another GGTS. Yes, I traded for a GGTS. This is a nice brushed one. Um, I've got a G, just GG and uh, I've still got all this old GG gear lying about, uh, you know, extenders and stealth caps and things like that, and uh, I couldn't resist it, I just couldn't resist it, so uh, I'm back with one of these again, and that's it, a thacker on top. I don't even know what's in that, I haven't vaped in it for so long. Um, what reviews have I done? Uh, did a review for the this wee guy, and uh, I swooned over this and said how good it was, and and uh, I still maintain it. You know, I, I'm still vaping away in this constantly. Uh, it is just <sighs> somebody said on feedback, wish they would include another coil. Uh, you know, just in case somebody buggers up the coil when they're taking the cotton out, uh, he is actually going to do that. He's going to include another head in the pack. We we're asking why I never showed how to recoil a micro coil in the video. Given the audience, it, it was just a review and a tutorial based on what the user would be expected to do. If they want to go down the micro coil route, that's entirely up to them. Loads of videos how to do that. Bloody hell. Uh, but, you know, still... Look at that, it's just, and it tastes gorgeous. Um, what else have we been up to? Uh, I'll have to show this off, I can't remember if I showed this off again. The IQ Hybrid. I was posting up that I was going to get another one. Um, I got this for a, such a silly price, uh, Ulian, Ulius, I can never remember how to pronounce his name. Uh, such a nice guy, him and his missus, a uh, really nice couple. Uh, but, you know, I think this was £50 delivered, or is it €50 Euros delivered? And it's, and it's, love it to bits, yeah, love it to bits. Um, what I also arrived today, I have had... The Taurus Customs um, tanks, quartz tanks, glass, quartz glass tanks for <laughs> for the key funds. Uh, well, uh, the the what arrived today. Well, they, they sent me glass and uh, they sent me one set of caps. So I asked them to send me another set of caps so that I could show you them side by side. I'll do a little review. But there's the standard size one, and there's the little nano sized one. Give you an idea of the difference. Now, there are, at this moment in time, there have been a couple of problems. Uh, Schmo Vapes sell these, by the way. been a couple of problems uh, which Taurus Customs are addressing, um, and you know, updates and all that will be on the Schmo Vapes website. I mean, filling the wee one was what a 
bugger. Uh, I mean, seriously, what a pain in the ass. Uh, but it's all done now. And I am now vaping on Spotted Dick. Yes, you heard me, Spotted Dick. Uh, this is from Mrs Lord. Uh, she sent it on to me. It's an incredible taste. It's it's, it's a pudding. Uh, I don't know. Was it suet and raisins and and it's just mm, nummy. <laughs> it's really good. I, I think it might be a guest liquid. You know that they're selling. I can't remember. There's a whole thing too. I can't remember which. But it's uh, at Mrs Lord's website. Um, so I've been vaping away with this and thoroughly enjoying it. Thoroughly enjoying it. And the wee nano is just what a beautiful little thing. It really is. I hope they get the issues sorted out soon. Uh, but I thoroughly enjoy it. That I'm actually vaping on just now. That's something else that's just turned up. That is a Witcher's Mods. Now is this the T1 or the T2? Or the T1 or the T2? There's a T1 and a T2. One, the extension tube goes up the way. The other one, the extension tube goes down the way. That's the only difference between the two of them. Uh, and I'll be doing a review of them coming up. Um, very similar to the the Witcher's mod, the, the, the Uranus. Getting them all in today, eh? Uh, wee bit spotted dick on my Uranus. <laughs> <laughs> so wrong! <laughs> what they also sent me was... Uh, this is a TH1. I think it's a TH1. That's the... Remember the Cyclone? Well, this is a Cyclone uh, on top. It's a hybrid. Uh, so you've got... Uh, it's kind of a fear going on. Oh, there's a battery in there. And it's a top-fed Genesis Atomizer. You know, the wick goes up into a tank. Um, which... I've always been a fan of. And I've always liked them. Uh, I've done loads of reviews on various different types. This one is just... I had the original Cyclone V2. It was one of the first reviews I did, I think. Uh, but this one... I've got to admit, I'll cover this in the review. The, you had such a tight little space to work on in the normal Cyclone. And I thought because this was a 22 mil version that they would, you know, it would be a slight, slightly different. You know, the posts would be further apart, but they're not. They're still so close together, and it can be a right footery bastard to build. Very cool vape. If you're into your fruits and stuff like that. Yes, I like my fruits <laughs> with my spotted dick. Um, I should give this up now. Uh, let's find a battery a minute. Something else to show you as well uh, before this review just goes tits up completely. Will this work? Um, if you saw the video for The golden retriever, the, the the golden dog, the golden dog, the the silver dog that got gold plated. Um, I did a review. I showed how that. Well, I sent my origin dripper. I sent it away and I got it copper plated. And this is it on my Anatolian Anatolian uh, hit it L E B D. So it's copper and copper. Uh, and I just, it's just the sweetest looking thing in the world. It's stunning. <laughs> it's beautiful. It really is. It's stunning. Um, and what else have we got? We've got the uh, little Vicious Ant Cyclone uh, with the airflow control. 
top fed one. No, I, I've reviewed a version of this before. I reviewed the standard one, which was a squonker. Uh, you know, the juice got fed up through the bottom. <laughs> so I like my fruits and juice up the bottom with some spotted dick. Um, right, the, this is just so wrong today, I don't know what's going on. Uh, so I'll be reviewing that as well. Uh, <laughs> great little vape. Um, I need a drink of coffee, I really do. Um, I've got quite a lot of stuff coming. Um, in fact, I've got loads of stuff coming. Um, why is this computer making so much noise? Go to sleep. That's the thing. Uh, I'm, I'm, I put out a shout out on Facebook. If anybody knows anybody, and this is a bit of a cheeky ask, anybody knows anybody that can do me a cracking deal on a, a good setup, desktop setup for video editing, uh, I'm looking for a bit of a Billy Bargain. Um, don't tell me how to build them. I know how to build them. I'm just too lazy to build them just now. Uh, but uh, anyway. There it goes, it's a, way to, it's a way to sleep now. Um, on a slightly different note, as I'm in a giverin' and gatherin' type mode today, um, I watched... <laughs> I watched uh, Saper, Sa Saper Vapor... Oh, the fuck. Saper Vapors! Uh, totally Wicked review. Daft bastards, the pair of them. Uh, no, kudos to them for going and doing it. Um, you know, it's. I saw a lot of the comments in their videos, and you know, not everybody's been around vaping all that long, or knows about all the politics and crap that went on with Totally Wicked. Uh, fair dues to the guys. They went in there, they reviewed a the product. If you listen to the video, you'll hear that they said for exactly what they thought of the advice. The device. I mean. And, you know, they gave an honest opinion. The only difference was they didn't swear like fucking troopers. But that was just, you know, they were in a working, they were in an office, so they couldn't. Uh, I feel sorry for them because it's going to be their first taste of, you know, it's their first taste of negative feedback and all the rest of it. I mean, you get used to it after a while. Um, but... I hope it doesn't put them off, and I, I hope they stick to what they do, because what they do, they do well, and uh, and they're you know they cover that side of the market really well, the pair of them, uh, and I hope they just you know in their own unique style tell the haters to fuck off, um, but uh, that's probably Tom now or Damien, you know sending me the money for putting this in the blog. Uh, nah, all the best to the guys and keep it up and just uh, guys, just ignore the haters and keep doing what you're doing. Um, twats the pair of you. Uh, right, what was I talking about? What else can I tell? Oh yeah, the Expromiser. Still loving this. Uh, it's just, I'm on my uh, mains powered USB pass through. Um, one of the guys on the site, uh, UK Vapors, posted In the pack, you'll get spare O rings. You want two O rings on the bottom. Mine hasn't been leaking, but uh, some people have had leaking from the bottom of the tank, and they're saying that uh, the bottom of the Tanky, tanky, uh, put a, another O ring on it and that stops it leaking. So, there's another little handy hinty, handy hinty, leaky leaky, losing it. Um, I've reviewed the Inakin I Taste 3 thing, oh, what, 314? No, can't remember now. Uh, the mini version, the review will be up probably tomorrow. Um, I've been putting a lot, of, a hell of a lot of reviews out, but uh, you know I've been keeping stuff for a week or so and using it, and then because I've, I'm not working just now, I can crack off three reviews in a day, and 
I'm releasing them a few days afterwards. Uh, I'm not doing a pile of reviews and releasing them that day. They're getting trickle fed out. Uh, do you know what? I, I, I don't really have anything to say. Um, I'd like to say hi to the guys on Reddit. Uh, popped in there to say hello. A couple of wankers on there, but not to worry. Everybody else was really nice. <laughs> um, the reason I popped on there, there uh, I saw Grim Green mention this a while back and looks like I'm suffering from it as well. There are people pretending to be... Todd has been cloned. There's a perishing thought. Um, people are getting in contact with vendors and asking for things to review. Um, same as Nick, uh, I never contact vendors. Ever, ever, ever contact vendors and ask for stuff for review. Doesn't happen. So if somebody contacts you pretending to be me, piss in a bottle and send it to them. Uh, that would be my advice. Um, so, scumbags. The, um, what else? Blog time, got to do something. What's that? Come on, Bershka. Come there, come no, that's my one. Get away. Um, have to introduce the dog. TJ. TJ is three years old. He's a working cocker spaniel. Uh, and he hates this mat because he can't get his claws on it. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Uh, right. Um, that's about it, guys. Uh, nothing much else to say. Uh, now that sneaky wee bam pot, my biscuit. What's this, TJ? Right. <laughs> That's enough of the dog. <laughs> it's Todd's reviews, not TJ's. You hear me? Right. I'm havering for the sake of havering now. Um, I can't think of anything else that I should be telling you. Um, upcoming reviews, I've got, let me see here. Now, I've got the, I've got things here I don't even know about, to be perfectly honest. The Witcher's mods I told you about. Oh, the Vision X-Fire, x, x uh, Remember the reviews I did for the, there were wooden mods. Uh, they had skulls on them and things like that. Uh, they've come out with a variable voltage uh, type looking one. And it looks really smart. That That's coming to me. A Vapor Shark DNA 30 box mod will be with me at the end of the month, hopefully. The Vapor Giant, which is a big hoofing 26650, is it? Mod. It's massive. Uh, it comes with a big uh, tank on it as well for K-Fun type vape. Uh, so that's coming. The V3 Flip uh, is coming as well. Uh, I'm really looking forward to that one. Oh, the TOBH Atty uh, is coming as well. The 22.4 Calibre by Vape Tech Systems. Can't even remember that one now. The Spire VVVW Mod. Uh, and, and you know there's other stuff here that I just haven't got a bloody clue who or when. The thing is, you get a lot of folk get in touch with you and say, yeah, I'll send you this on for review. And uh, you add it to the list and then you never hear from them again. Um, yeah, that's it. Sorry, it. Let's go. Uh, you guys have a cracking week. Uh, enjoy your weekend first, of course. And uh, we shall... Catch up with you later. <laughs> Something wrong with me in the day. Don't know what it is. Too much sleep. Feeling all rested. Uh, that's it. <laughs> Slangeva.